Today's presentation is about engagement ring settings and it's brought to you by www.qualityvintageengagementrings.com. Now to start off with, I want to talk about what exactly the engagement ring setting is. Um, it's actually the metal that holds the gemstones in place. A lot of people don't realize that it's both functional and beautiful at the same time, um, but the setting makes up you know, the overall design of the ring, how it looks, and it also is very secure and sturdy to hold those gemstones in place so they don't fall out. So it's important that as you're picking an engagement ring setting that you choose one that's going to be very functional to hold your stones and also be very beautiful at the same time. Um, keep in mind that there are very, very many different types of settings to choose from, different styles, lots of options out there. Um, you can choose different metal types or designs or anything that you want um, because there are, you know, like I said, there are tons of options to choose from. So on that note, let's talk a little bit about some suggestions that I have for you if you're choosing an engagement ring setting. Um, first of all, consider what type of stone you're going to be using because there are several factors that come into play with the gemstones. Um, if you're going with a diamond, then you know pretty much any setting can hold that stone, but if you're going to choose a softer type of gemstone, like an opal for example, that rules out some of the setting types because of the softness of that stone. Um, also, you want to consider how big the stone is. If you have lots of smaller stones, then you're going to choose a different type of setting than if you're just going to do one big stone. Um, the second thing to consider is what style do you like? Do you have a preference? Do you prefer something softer and more feminine? Or are you looking for the bold and the big style? Um, there are lots to pick from, so my suggestion is just to look at a lot of pictures and you know see what you like, see what matches your personality. Really, the the engagement ring setting is a display of the bride's personality, so you want to make sure to get a good style that she's happy with. Um, we do have a lot of ring pictures on our website, so check it out if you get a chance. Um, that should help you, you know, find the, the style that you like and maybe find a ring that you prefer. Um, our website was www.qualityvintageengagementrings.com. The next point to consider is what your daily activities are. Um, just because the ring settings hold the stones in a different way and protect them in a different way. And also, the way that it sits on your finger is, is variable depending on what type of setting you choose. For example, if you're using your hands a lot during the day, you know, constantly in motion and you don't want it to get caught on clothing or hair or anything else that you're working with, you're going to want to go with a, a ring setting that is lower and closer to your hand. Um, because if you choose like a higher, for example, like a cathedral type of setting, it's not going to be very functional for you and then you're going to find yourself taking off your ring and you know, you don't want to lose it or damage the stone by getting it caught on things. So I would definitely suggest that if your daily activities include a lot of use of your hands, go with a lower, you know, a lower profile ring setting. Don't go with one of those high, high settings. The last thing to take into consideration when you're choosing an engagement ring setting is your budget. Um, of course, this is, is different for everyone, but the budget does play a big factor because r some ring settings are, are cheaper than other ring settings. So sit down and, and determine a budget and then find a ring setting that fits within the budget that you have. So that's just a quick overview of engagement ring settings. Um, because of the time constraints of this presentation, I don't have a lot of time to go into details about specific settings, but we do have all of those details on our website. So go look at it and you can see different pictures and get uh, you know detailed descriptions about specific ring settings. And we also have lots of other information about diamond shopping and engagement rings in general. And that website was www.qualityvintageengagementrings.com.